Hello, this is Kanako. Today I'm going to talk about Japanese tidying up. Because I was called Konmari and doing, doing the Japanese tidying up consulting service in Shanghai. So today I'm going to teach you how to do a goodbye body with things. How many things of just in case do you have? Open your storage and how many things do you use? It's okay to have like a seasonal things. Oh, every winter I use it, so I keep it in the summer. However, you also have like just in case maybe this one broken or maybe I lose someone and something. Just in case products. Oh, I'm talk about about this. So the last time we did why it's good to do the uh, tidying up. There are many good things. Basically, you save four things. You save time. You don't have to look for it. You save money. You don't have to buy the same thing again. And you save space. You It looks good. And most importantly, you save your mind, you feel good, and you feel peace inside of you. So, let's go back to today's topic, the good bar. There are two kind of things. One is just a product, and it's easy, relatively easy to say goodbye. But other things are hard, for example, something with your memory. Memory with your grandmother, memory with the ex-boyfriend, memory of when you were young, memory of when you got some award. And what you should do? The correct answer is doing the goodbye body. Yes, you take time of it and then make the party and to break it or to make it uh, dirty but it's not a bad meaning it's all like thankful and you're saying like I graduate from you I don't need to have it the actual things I'm going forward to the next step that's a party for example uh, maybe this pen is something the memorial pen because your grandma gave it to you and this is a very important pen, but you don't really use it. And the, or maybe only there is no inks in it. So what do you do? First, you take a picture with it. Maybe if it's with someone, you can take the picture with someone. Or if not, you can take it with yourself or just buy just a pen itself is okay. So if it's in the um, picture, you can make the file of I like it file and you put it instead of having the actual product and you take it with your hand that's important and then you think about it all the good memories with this pen oh like grandma was very nice person and she gave it to me la 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 and you remember about your grandma and then um, you say Arigato which means thank you thank you for all the memories and thank you for everything the good thing so that's a goodbye body you take time for it and then you say goodbye and thank you And I also recommend to, for example, to make it dirty. And if you have kids, it's good to have a, like a spaghetti party using uh, products because if it's easy to get it dirty. But remember to talk about your your grandma or your memory when you're eating spaghetti. Yeah, you decide what kind of party you have. Maybe you can bring it to the your favorite coffee shop and eating cakes and remember all the good memory. So, 
the summary of today, how to do the goodbye body, is you take the actual products and then you'll think about it and thankful. Saying, Arigato, thank you. I'm going forward, not to the past, to the future. That's a good thing. So, the cycle of products. It's okay to buy new things because new things has power, but you have to say goodbye to the old memory. Right. If you like this video, please uh, like it and then register my channel. Thank you. Bye.